Well, the second and final day of tacos and tequila is uh, happening right now, and already the turnout surpassed previous years, making the whole event work was the people behind the scenes. Crime 2's Connor McAvoy gives us a look at the festival. I'm in charge of making sure things are clean, so I am putting plastic bags on the, the buckets and changing them whenever they get full. Olga Lucia Herreras volunteered at Tacos and Tequilas all four years the event's been hosted. This year, she's in charge of garbages, and she's having fun doing it. You see what people waste, and but how much people have bought and how much food was sold, and since this is a fundraiser, I was happy to see that. A fundraiser done by Nuestras Raíces Centro Comunitario, which is an organization designed to raise positive awareness for members of the Hispanic community. Their funds from the festival going towards their community center. And just on Saturday... We had a turnout that was equivalent to the last three years in amount of people. So we doubled the amount of folks that attended. Executive Director Fernanda Mascot looks forward to the event every year. With roughly 32 volunteers putting things together each day, that doesn't include multiple businesses making food or drinks for those in attendance, with 10% of their profits going towards youth scholarships through the organization. Our volunteers that are doing their you know, their, their diligence, their work, they're doing it proudly because they know they're giving back to their community and they're giving back to the community center. So folks like Herrera can make sure all the garbages are within people's reach, knowing that any job is not too small to help with what everyone wants to achieve. The more money they fund and the more we can help um, young people go to college. And that's the ultimate goal. In Spokane, Connor McAvoy, Creme 2 News.